All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. We're dueling against Opalus Twi Titty Twister. Just wanted to point that out. <laughs> anyway, welcome back. Uh, we are playing Mecha Phantom Beast, and we only have one week left, people. One week left of Daily Duels. This time, next week, Daily Duels will essentially be over, you know? We'll be doing the 1000 Grand Finale live stream. Uh, it'll go from 8 a.m. Pacific time to 12 p.m. Pacific time, so if you can join us, it'll be up on the channel. That'd be great. That'd be fantastic if you'll be able to join us. Uh, let's duels. I don't know. I don't know. I should've probably went first, because now this is going to be a little bit difficult, I must say. <laughs> so, this guy's actually pretty good. At first, I was kind of like, eh, but he's actually pretty good. He puts everybody down, and he needs to, to flip down, and summon, and flip down, and summon, and flip down, and summon, and flip down. It's like, okay. So this is a counter, so if a card's a card you destroy, you have to go ahead and summon a Metaphog monster from your deck, so that's awesome. But I don't think he has really anything to interrupt my plays, so I should be able to bust out a Crystal Meth right now. Like, busting out a Crystal Meth right now would kind of shut him the fuck up, you know? It's like, it's like, what would he do? So the problem is, is that a lot of these cards are really good. So I guess I would attack you, and then when you would flip up, I'd just negate and kill you. Yeah. There's really no point in me playing Twin Twister or anything right now. So, who do, who, um, whom do I grab? I guess i just talk a Tom Borg, and then talk a Tom Borg with summon the Red Eye Dice, and then, then summon Clear Wing, and then Crystal Wing. I guess that's how it would be. Do I have Black Rose in here? Like, if I have Black Rose in here, I might just blow this man back. I don't. God damn it. Uh, I'm so, oh, wait. It's right there. It's right there. It's right there. You know what? Mmm. I could. I really could. And that'd be so good. Just to blow all these motherfuckers away. I mean, he'll still get this, which kind of sucks. But, you know what? I'm going to say it's worth. I'm going to say it's worth. Because I'm, I'm not stuck. I'm not stuck to only, uh. I'm not stuck to only win monsters until I do Tonka Tomborg. So if I don't do Tonka Tomborg, then I can just blow your nipples back with a fucking Black Rose. Because there is nothing for you to stop me. So thank you for setting all the monsters and doing all them cute plays. Like, yeah, just Black Rose button. Just Black Rose. Like, get out of here. You don't, you don't need them flip monsters. Damn. <laughs> and this card has to be on um, the field of results, so he doesn't even get that. I thought, like, no, he can't even chain it. So he got his nipples blown the fuck the back like holy shit <laughs> i'm gonna say i'm gonna go ahead and set these three and then i'll just pass like wow <laughs> yay i mean now i can't crystal meth wait yeah i can yeah i can summon this this will search me for wait uh, i might not be able to i mean he's not done he's not done i'm trying to think how i can crystal meth summon this this will search me for this could be my red eye die so really i just need a level four Oh, yeah, you get your pendulum skills back. Now, I'm kind of wondering the order in which you're going to do things, because if you put your pendulum scale, then activate your filled spell, I will gladly just twin twist them both. <laughs> no, he activated Hidden City first. All right. Oh, he's not out. He's not out. You know, the counter will grab him back, and then that will grab him back, and... Wow, he's literally just going to do the same exact play all over again. So if I'm warning that, then... What does it say? This card on the field is destroyed by battle by card effect and center guard, but it was it's not technically on the field because he never summoned, right? I'm not crazy, right? No, I'll just leave it alone. Like, I'll leave it alone. I'll let him do his metal plug plays. Metal floods can block the archer, you know. But uh, don't, don't worry. Despite the live stream being on Wednesday, we're not going to be playing only this deck. We're going to play this deck, tweak it, probably make a different... Uh, uh, Mecha Fan Beast deck because this is no more speed rides. I mean, there's Mecha Fan Beast and they do have combo and synergy, uh, but Mecha Fan Beast kind of suck. <laughs> I I I had to admit that they they kind of suck. So so then you will go off and then I can just warn you, right? Yeah, I'm just warning that. Like, I really would prefer if you don't summon a whole bunch of sub terrors on my ass. <laughs> oh, oh, this card is transmodify. And I guess I could turn into a higher level monster. <laughs> but I really don't think it's a point. So, yeah, I can go into Crystal Meth. I would just have to get a level 4. 
No. No, because I need a tuner. And I could get Duke. I could get Duke. And I could transmodify them and turn this up. This card's normal. Oh, wait, I could just summon this. Like, double yo yo. Summon. No. Yeah, double yo yo. Summon back my red eye dice. Red eye dice do your effect. Special summon Taco Tombor. Taco Tombor summon my second red eye dice crystal meth. Yeah. That works. That works. Because I haven't conducted a normal summon. That works. So we're going to be playing all the decks. We're going to have tag partners. going to be tagging with them. Tagging with you guys. You already know. Like we, we're going to wrap this series up well. <laughs> so. Go ahead and use your effect. So I guess I'll keep the double yo-yo. So. Taco Tom board. You can go up to. Seven. I mean six. So I can six seven. And then I'll go into a crystal mess, and then he'll be in some deep shit, my dog. Like, I'm so glad I ran the black rose. <laughs> like, I was kind of worried that I didn't, but in the end, I did. And it's like, yay! So it should be two off. And the red eye die. Damn. Yep. And he scoops. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Ah, oh, that's what we wait. He's like, oh, here comes the Christmas. It's like, you know it, buddy. You know. You know. All right, we're going to duel. Right back. All right, got another duel. Oh, shit. <laughs> and I looked at his name, and his name is literally Ophion. So if you bust out an Ophion on my ass, and that's, mm, <laughs> that's pretty much GG. <laughs> that, that would be pretty much GG. Y'all look like a level one deck. Oh, no, it's GG's with, wait, with this? Like, why? Why? Why Kinky Bio? King of Bio. Like, okay. So it was DDDs. Ugh. And I got the warnings and the vanities and the. Like, this is definitely a going first hand. Like, I've been noticing this deck likes to go first. Like, the chunk cards just make this deck want to go first. So it'd be someone a clear wing or a synchro monster with the wings and the vanities and the warning. Like, but he he, he won Paper Rock Scissors. So he's like, I want to go first with DDDs. Like, okay. <laughs> okay. So. Question is, can I blow this man back with a black rose? Uh, yeah, I can. Cause he's just summon Teratop. Teratop search me for a red eye dice. Summon red eye dice. Make it, make six, sink seven, blow up everything, everything, everything. So, <laughs> but then of course this is after this guy uh, does all his plays and stuff like that. So, okay. I'm, I'm, where, where are you going with this? Okay, then you're gonna see with that into that. Okay. Then you're gonna detach the slime. Okay. So you get the Twin Twister to your hand. Okay. Is that the Twin Twister? Oh, shocker. Because I don't know what that set card is. Man, I got a Twin Twister of my own, so I'm gonna go ahead and special summon. I take my effect. Uh, we're just gonna play the Black Rose card, the Black Rose game. It's called, it's called, uh, Who Likes Black Rose? I like Black Rose. <laughs> This, this, make me six, and it's time for you to get Black Rose, my dog. Like, yeah, you want to go first and do all your fucking cute plays, and I'm like, no. Black Rose. <laughs> Gone. At least Genghis gets you something back. So you get that back to your hand. Yay! You know what? I might take the neg on the twin twister. Cause I don't want you to do any more searching. The problem is the rest of my hand is kinda ugh. Like, I'm probably gonna pitch the strike because I have a vanities in another strike. Hold on to the Taka Tombor, because of course the Taka Tombor could be something else. I think I might take the neg on the twin twister. Just to make sure that he doesn't search for anything else. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> like, this is my one opportunity to get rid of that shit. Sure. I'll take a thousand life points. Watch him just get another one. Uh. So there's no point in striking it because it would just stay in the graveyard. I could vanities, but I really don't have anything else right now. Like, I kind of need a special summon too. Like, I'll, I'll let that go. I'll take the damage. I'll take the damage. Go ahead and fuse. Amazing, I could just stop the fusion monster's effect. Like, just open up with so much macro. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. No, it's fine. 
out of any Zakin monster summoned. Oh, yeah, I did take a neg with my Twin Twister, but you know what? It's not terrible to just stop him from doing his plays. I think I would have been in even hotter water if I would have let him do his plays and if I let him not, so. Uh. So, I mean, these are both tuners. Oh, if I do this, I, I can go to Armides, but what the fuck does Armides do? Ah, uh, that sucks. Yeah, that sucks. Like, this can sync with this, and I get our mateys in a token, but what the fuck does that do? Yeah? I know Catastro would have been. No, wait, you're dark. <laughs> ah, damn it. <laughs> ah, fuck. If you want a tuner, if you weren't a tuner, I probably would have been okay. I think I might just set you. But then, at least with token, at least with the, the token. I would have it special summon because it's a win, and I could tribute, make a summon Duke, and then go into Sync 6. I, ugh, I didn't need it all. It's a Mecha Phantom Beast, and I, back, I do the Mecha Phantom Beast, and it's just like, God damn it, like, that's not what I needed. Or at least a different Mecha Phantom Beast. Like, this one's just, uh, if it was the level 4 one, like, yeah, you know, summon the level 4 one, special summon this, Sync, you know, oh my god, great. Great, I'm gonna have to stop that. I'm gonna have to stop that, like... This deck just has so many ways to get that fucking shit. So many ways. No. I need to stun the DDD. I can't I can't have him, you know, going off and getting all his plays and cards and shit right now. It'd be terrible for me. Uh, get me a nice Mecha Fan Beast token, so it really comes down to what I draw. I'm not down on resources, but I'm not doing too bad. Wings. Okay, well, I can go into Stardust Charge Warrior and then Wings. It's like if it battles like a level 5 or higher monster. Like, I think I'll do that. I think I'm gonna special summon this. And this contribute off. If he lets me do it. I mean, he does have two pieces of background. Wouldn't be surprised if they were just like strike and something else. Strike and warning. Because <laughs> DDs don't play a lot of background. Like, maybe it's like Witch or something? He has to have a card in his hand for that. No idea what his set cards could be. Is there vanities? Do we both have vanities? Do we both get vanities? Chalice. Do I tribute for cost? I think I tribute for cost. You can tribute this card. Suppose someone. Oh, so it was a good chalice. Okay, okay. I was kind of wondering how that would go down. I mean, I was going to lose it anyway. Ah, uh, I kind of needed that. Uh, now, now I really don't have anything. I would have been able to bust out a Synchro Monster, I would have been okay, the wings would have helped me out. Like, it's just one of those duels where if I would have went first, this duel would have been a lot different. Because I went second, I had to burn up a lot of resources. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Ah oh, shit. <laughs> This might be game. Like, I, I, it's a sad moment when I black rose the guy and he still beats me because I don't get anything else. Like, all right, yeah. Uh, like, vanities would be great if I had something. If that play didn't get stopped, I would have busted out my Stardust Charge Warrior, who would have drew me a card. You would have ran into this, chasing wings, because I would have definitely flipped out vanities when you fucking summoned that Lamia. Like, wow. Like, he's literally, like, I haven't let him search at all. He's literally just been drawing into everything that he needs. Draw, draw, draw. It's like, fuck. Oh, now I get the strike. All right, all right, now I get the strike. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Like, the strike would have been great last fucking turn when he synced into this. Then I actually would have been okay. Like, oh my god. So. So you activate that diffuse, and I can flip up vanities, and you're probably saying the gate, and then I can play strike on you. Okay, you know, I thought you maybe like banished for cost or something, but you don't. So you're gonna be like, hell no, I want my curse. No, I want that slime, and I'm gonna be like, yeah, I can, I can strike that. But then chain resolves backwards. But Vanity's starts a separate chain, right? Yeah, so that's gone. Vanity's will block this. Yeah, you already used this effect this turn, right? Am I safe for one turn? Can I top deck a terror top and do some plays? Uh, two more tarot tops left? Ah, yes! Let's go! <laughs> can I top deck a tarot top? Yes, you may! Ha <laughs> ha! 
That's pretty good. <laughs> um, I'm still thinking Starter's Charge Warrior. I have a red eye dice in the graveyard, so I could just summon it back and then sink it to a seven. So Duke would Duke would be a good grab. Just normal summon Duke. Yeah, normal summon Duke. Sink. And I could summon I could summon the dice back if I want to, because getting that additional draw will be helpful to stay in this duel. Oh my god, that was a beautiful top deck. That was a beautiful, beautiful top deck. That's exactly what I need to draw. <laughs> That's actually legitimately funny. Mm. No, now I could go into Crystal Mask because I can summon Duke, can summon back my Red Eye die. Yeah, I can summon my Red Eye die, and then I can transmodify into another, into a lion. Yeah. Yeah. They like said he thinks I'm gonna sink seven. He thinks that I'm gonna sink seven, but now I'm like, no, my dog, transmodify, turn this into a lion. <laughs> sink eight. Crystal meth. Crystal meth is here! <laughs> Save the day! Oh, that was a beautiful top deck. Ah. So he still has his uh, contract. He can still fuse, but what fusion monster can he go into to handle crystal meth? Because crystal meth will just fuck him up, you know? You can go ahead and take that thousand. Yeah. Guy will I actually be able to beat DDD? <laughs> I mean, he, can he like send this to summon the Lamia back? You can do that. At least turn this off because he's gonna get burned. But I'm just kind of wondering if he's gonna do it. Yeah, he's gonna go ahead and fuse. Yep. He can pretty much fuse a lot because he has a whole bunch of monsters in the graveyard. But all your monsters have levels, and you fuck up with you fuck with Crystal Meth, you get the fucking dick. So. Alright, so what do you do? Oh, if you attack the D monster you control attacks, face appears damage once you turn your standby phase, you can ooh. Ooh, so So yeah, summoning that token wasn't the correct decision to do. That'd give me a little bit more defense. I forgot about this guy. He's not out in the TCD, so I don't think this activates. I think this is just a continuous effect, so I don't even think I can go crystal crystal meth, kill him. Yeah, he doesn't even activate, I just take all that damage. Like ow. I had 200 life points left. <laughs> Ooh, here's another set card. I wouldn't be surprised if it's like a Forbidden Chalice or something. Ooh, if it's a Forbidden Chalice. Well, I, I get Chasing Wings. I'm not setting this. <laughs> I, I'm not doing anything with this. I'm just gonna attack. <laughs> like, like, I got Chasing Wings. If he tries to be cute. No, oh, Crystal Meth kill you. So I take two thousand, you take three thousand. I would not be surprised if this man tries to like stall me out. If he just keeps on doing his Oh wait, he's gonna get burned for another thousand. Yep. So you can do that one more time. I'd say I'd say do your fusion, then get rid of it with Lamia. Maybe sink, maybe. But if not, just get rid of that shit with Lamia, because you are taking way too much burn damage. <laughs> you got one more turn. I got one more turn. <laughs> Like, life points don't mean shit until they hit zero, people. <laughs> oh, my darkness going going in. I mean, if he top, if he gets a regeki, I would. Oh wait, no, I got chase. I say if he gets a regeki, I would suck. But I got chasing wings. I love this card. Like, makes me want to play in like all my synchro decks. This is so good. <laughs> all right, he's again. Probably something in defense position. See, it's risky, because I'm thinking it's probably going to... Oh, right, he just scooped. I win! Woo! Awesome. Ah, that was, that was a close one. Thank you for top digging that terror top. If I didn't talk about the terror top, that would have been game. See? See, people? Just believe in the heart of the cards. Uh, we got time for one more duel. We're back. All right, got another duel. Like, that, that, was, that was lucky. We both got lucky in that duel. Yeah. It's my, I just outlucked him just, just a little bit. Just, just a tad bit. Just a tad bit. Wow, wow. He starts and then just loses connection. Yeah. All right, I mean, that hand wasn't fantastic anyway. I didn't get any trap cards. There we go, there we go. Wow, so I can actually do one of the best plays that this deck has right now, which is summon a lion and then transmodify into Terra Top. <laughs> like, yeah, that's totally fair. Like this, it's one of the key reasons why I wanted to do this deck because I mean, that play is just so awesome. <laughs> so, 
Uh, I could attrition. <laughs> like I could. I can summon. I can get Duke, and I can summon Duke with the token with it, the, and then yeah, I could. But do I want to? I mean, I, I think I want Duke because I want a Tuna Monster. I could sink seven. I could sink eight. Think six. Thinking six with this. Yeah. Wait, I already normal summoned this turn. I should have got Takatambork. Oops. I forgot I normal summoned this turn. I legitimately forgot I normal summoned this turn. I mean, I could think five or eight, but I think I took my eight out. Plus, there'd be no point in my eight right now. Like, I, I, that was a misplay. Should have got, should have got Takatambork. I mean, should have got. Yeah, Takatan board, brush them in tribute, then summon Duke. Like, I skipped a step because I forgot I actually normal summon this turn. Uh, I said I could summon a line with a line and then sink five or sink eight, but I don't have any eight. So sink five and turn Mades, but. Just hold off for now. That was a misplay. I, I, I fucked up. Definitely should have got Takatan board, start summon Takatan board, tribute it all. Then I could summon Red Eye Dice or Duke. Like, that was a misplay. <laughs> Good job, Daniel. Always back at it again with messing up. Hey, I'm not perfect. No one said I'm perfect at, at Yu-Gi-Oh. She's been so busy lately. Said so Yu-Gi-Oh is such a job. I, mean, I can't wait for my break. Yeah, 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 I get a break. It's been like, I think it's been like almost a year. I think it's been over a year since I've took in a, taken a break from Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, I don't think the Sonic Bird is scary. I think whatever he ritual summons and activates the effect of it is scary. So I think I'll leave that alone. Because for all I know, he could be playing fucking Chaos Max. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, oh my god, if he summoned Chaos Max, I'd be dead. <laughs> I'd be dead. <laughs> He'd be like a venture to I send blue eyes, summon Chaos Max, pierce this, double pierce, dead. Like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> That'd be the end of the video. I'd be so ashamed, I'd have to hide in my face. I'd be like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I do the clan. <laughs> uh, I think I'm just gonna summon Duke and then go into charge and then draw a card. And then I could summon the lion and then go into Crystal Meth. The deck has synergy. The deck has synergy. It gives me like level two tuner. Like I got level one tuner, level two tuner, and level three tuner. Like it works. It works. Charge. Draw me a card. Love drawing. Draw. Yay! Another strike. Uh, the thing is, do I want to set that? <laughs> uh, so now I think I'll just go ahead and do a lion, and the lion will summon me a lion. Give me a, well the additional normal summon a lion. And Crystal Meth, yay, Crystal Meth! <laughs> Waiting. Waiting on you, sir. You got this? This is gonna stop me? Yay. Synchron Crystal Meth. Ah, uh, vicinity. Oh, well, I mean, he doesn't have like a strike or warning or anything back there. Back over it? 616? Yay. Uh, this is the risky thing. Because I could set another strike, but then Twin Twister popped it both strikes. Or I can let him take the neg and he'll pop one of my strikes. Like, I, I think I'm okay. Especially with Crystal Meth, I think I'm okay just to leave it alone. I, I don't, I hate setting two now. It's just, I'm asking to be Twin Twister. I'm just begging for it. Oh shit, it is fucking, uh. It is, uh. Uh, blue eyes. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh, that's fine. Ah, oh, shit. I was like, I was like, it's, it's not blue eyes, right? Wow, wow, wow. All right. So I would say he, I could set two and then get blown back, or I could not. I have to negate this. I, I have to. If I don't negate Senju, I'm dead because he could just get Chaos Max. Like I have to negate Senju. I have to. Because if I don't, Chaos Max will fuck me up. Because then he'll get Chaos Max. He already has the the. Venture Show Art. Venture Art. Someone pierced my, my token. I'm dead. You know? Like, I, at first I was like, no, he's not playing Blue Eyes. He's not playing Chaos Max. Yes, he is. Like, oh, shit. <laughs> so, I have to negate this. If he wants to use his alternative and blow up my fucking Crystal Wing, then more power to you. But at least I don't get hit with Chaos Max. At least I don't get hit with Chaos Max. Like, I'll take that. Because then, at least I have a turn. Watch him just have the Chaos Max in his hand. Like, okay. Yay! He quit! Because he already knew that I had hella resources, hella plays, and I was going, I think I'm going to trish this man. Like, I can summon double yo yo, and then double yo yo can summon me. Wait, no. There's nothing in there. 
picks on the gated. I could search for uh no. No. I could just wait, I have Duke. I could summon. And that could special me su special special me summon. Special summon terror top, terror top, get the surge. Duke banish summon. And then just level modulate, so I could probably like <sighs> Um like the terror top up to what? One, two, three, four, five. Up to the top, up to five. Trish. Trish this man. But no, P quit. Yay! Oh, thank Christ he didn't have Chaos Max in the opening hand. He, he got the Rancher's Yard. I was kind of scared. I had to negate the Senju. Like I said, that was the smart thing to do. The wrong thing to do was not negate the Senju, because then he would just... Rancher's Yard, send the blue eyes, Chaos Max, attack, pierce the token, double pierce dead. You know? But instead, I won, because I was smart. I'm smart. I am so smart. SMRT. All right, people, we are done here. So... We have one week left. One week of Daily Duels goodness. And uh, that's it. That's it. Daily Duels will be over. Uh, and I'll take my break from my channel. Come back. And like I said, what I'm planning on doing is Monday, Monday, Wednesday, car review. Tuesday, Thursday, sleep. Friday, fake car Friday. Saturday, vitamin wild stream. Sunday, what Daily Duels will be replaced by, which is instead of Daily Duels, it's now Daniel Duels. Ah, because I'm Daniel and I'll be dueling. Yeah. And it's similar to vitamin Y, where we play whatever. You know, so that way we're not locked down by anything. We could make and play whatever. So don't worry, they'll still get dueling content. It just won't be every single day, which would be much easier for me because recording and doing daily duels every day is that was a lot of work, and especially with how busy I am. So yeah, you know, I don't even have my teaching job yet, so you guys still got to take that into consideration. Once I become a teacher, that would be even uh, even more work. So I think these channel changes will be for the best. I think it will be. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Uh, episode of Daily Duels. So, one week left. This is episode 995. Thanks for watching, thanks for all support, and I will see you guys tomorrow tagging, playing with Gaia. Hopefully it works better than it's been working because that deck just hates me. <laughs> uh, maybe we can tweak it work on it during the live stream. Alright people, thanks for watching.